here is the pure chaos of <laughs> what used to be the advent calendar. <laughs> Damn, this camera is good. Hi guys, welcome to Vlogmas day five. I'm getting a pretty late start today. Also, this is definitely gonna be a makeup free vlog. So this is what you're getting today. I'm breaking out so bad. Honestly, my skin after coming home from Chicago has been a hot, hot mess. I think like going back and forth from like warm, dry climate to cold, harsh wind, dry climate, my skin's like, <laughs> I don't know what to do. Anyways, another day, another hat. I'm washing my hair tomorrow, thank God. I'm doing a scalp treatment tonight. We are on the road to recovery. It's not recovery. You don't recover from psoriasis. You manage psoriasis, which 10 out of 10 do not enjoy. Anyways, uh, today is painting day. Today is finish the canvas day. And I am just stopping at a uh, like local news and magazine stand place. This one is my absolute favorite. It's like literally just like on the side of a CVS, but it has the best selection. It's got so many like really cool, trendy, like coffee table book vibes. So I wanna grab a few of those so I can like rip pages and graphics out to add them onto the canvas. In day four Vlogmas, I got a few really good, like ironic slash just like funny and witty uh, text ideas to do with those big letters on the canvas. So I think I've got a few to choose from, but I definitely wanna do that on top of some like black paint, uh, some more graphics and maybe a little bit more color. I find it very difficult to paint without color. So anyways, that's the plan for today. Uh, I'm gonna get, also I just realized I have this, I mean like this is just the look of the last two years, but I just realized how weird it looks. Okay, so anyways, mask on, let's go get some magazines. Man, this camera is so good. I can't believe that I've had this phone for so long and haven't been vlogging with the cinematic mode. Oh my God. Oh my god what's up billy oh my god they didn't have a like an unopened one but oh my god so good oh my god there's like leaves and just dog hair all up in the car uh mission accomplished that cost 60 dollars. i forgot how expensive like coffee table books are but um now we got we got graphic pages for days i always feel so weird sitting in front of this bed. like it makes me think that we're like filming a main channel video but then like the relief that i feel when it's just like a chill no makeup vlog is like this is very nice okay uh, heavy coffee table magazine book haul. We've got the Billie Eilish ID. She looks so good, oh my God. Here's my perspective on pulling pages from these. I think as long as you leave the cover intact and like the sides of it looks kind of un mostly untouched, I'm like, I would still put this on a shelf, 100%. Uh, okay, so we've got ID, we've got Flaunt, which I've bought before that usually have like such good like art pages. This is gonna go very poorly. I feel like I'm, I've never, oh, this smells like new book. New book kind of smells bad. I probably just offended so many bookworms who like love that smell and like thrive off of it. Which is not for me. You know what other smell I really hate that is very controversial is the smell of new car interiors. Nothing makes me more nauseous and car sick faster than being in a car that still has the new car smell. It's my literal nightmare. It is my actual, ooh, what this? Free gift with purchase. I think this is try to enroll me into a school maybe? And half of it might be in Italian. I am for sure gonna pronounce it wrong. Virtus, Virtus, Virtus? There's a small part of me that wants to be like Virtus, but I think it's like Virtus, Vir Virtus maybe? It's a magazine slash, I feel wrong calling it a magazine because she's so thick, but it's translated in here in multiple languages. I th think it's Italian, but I'm not sure. I don't know, here, let me show you a page and then you can tell me what language this is in. It's definitely not French. Please don't roast me, please don't come for me. Please don't come for me. Okay, here's... Here's, wait, wait, focus. Here's one page. 
what language is this? <laughs> so I usually go into this like not really knowing what I'm looking for, um, but I'm gonna pull a bunch of pages and then realistically I'll probably use other ones later on in different projects. I'm gonna start with this one because she is the smallest, the most doable to kick us off with. Oh my God, Beyonce and Jay-Z. For Tiffany and Co, what a flex. What a hot couple. Okay, I'm gonna put on Selling Sunset season four, almost done the season and flip through these and I think we'll probably find some good shit. a hard time with this freaking heart oh my god this little heart here is swimming in spray paint i'm really concerned if it's gonna dry or not i genuinely went over it with spray paint so many times to like try and get a version of it that i like i just don't know i don't know i don't know so i guess options are that we can just keep it as is and i could do the letters kind of over it um, I think what I'm gonna do is big letters that says masterpiece, even though this is nowhere near a masterpiece. Um, I think it's like a funny, ironic, like little text portion to add on top. But the rest of it, big fan of the rest of it. I, I love the way the rest of it's turning out, but just this heart is killing me. It is breaking my heart. It is bringing me so much, uh, I don't even know, so much, so much anger. You know what, I will say, it does look better on camera than I think I maybe realized. I'm gonna add a little bit of a uh, white, I think to this area right here and then maybe a little bit of white on here but I can't add literally if I had one more layer of spray paint like it's gonna slide off so this is gonna be a two-parter I think within the vlog because to do letters like this needs a solid solid at least maybe like I, I want to say 24 hours and then what I'm thinking for masterpiece is going like right here all the way up so having it be a, a vertical actually wait so no hang on it would be here, oh god, tripping, tripping, tripping. The M would be here and we'd go masterpiece all the way down the side there. So it would overlap the heart a little bit. Um, but I think that might be the vibe. Um, okay, so here's uh, here's what we are working with right now. Hello, it is later. I'm in, I'm in rough shape, y'all. I'm in rough shape. If we're, Roo -roo. If we're being fully honest with each other as, as vlog besties, I've definitely been fucking with my birth control a little bit and uh, I definitely should have had my period probably two weeks ago, but I just like, I just want to put it off a little and just, I just wasn't, it wasn't the vibe, it wasn't the vibe. So anyways, I was like, okay, like I need to have my period. I'm on the Nuvering, by the way. And so essentially your period just like doesn't start until you take it out and then you have your period and then you put a new Nuvering in a week later and uh, all is well and no babies. I have a track record of not being super responsible with um, being on time with the whole cycle portion. Everything's been great though. So like maybe I'm infertile or I've just been lucky. Either way, not a great habit. I don't suggest it because it has caused me anxiety in the past. Never had like a pregnancy scare or anything, but like it's not my best habit. I definitely should have had my period probably two weeks ago. And I feel like when I fuck with the natural cycle of what my body's probably supposed to do, my cramps end up being much, much worse. And so then I pay the price, which feels fair for sure like it feels very deserved and very fair but it does not make the suffering better so anyways i got cramps right now real bad and i'm gonna eat this ravioli to make my heart feel better it's probably not gonna make my stomach feel better but my stomach already feels bad so i figured that like you know two birds one stone let's just let's just enjoy the ravioli i feel like that's not the proper use of two birds one stone because that means like two yeah, that wasn't quite right. I'm just gonna take the L um, and enjoy the ravioli because I don't foresee my cramps getting better for the next couple of days. So, um, hate that for me. If we are cycle sisters currently, love that for us, but also hate these cramps for us as well. I also don't know in what kind of bold world I think it's a good idea to eat this ravioli in my new Miss Remy Ashton Vlogmas hoodie, which is white though. So I'm gonna take this off and just eat without a shirt on. Um, so that it, I don't have an incident. Huh. Uh...
Oh god, I feel like you're not supposed to hate these up this much. Uh, 20? Um, please don't explode. Okay, that was 20. How's she feeling? Oh, double, baby. Let's go. Oh god. Uh, <laughs> 25? Here we go. This is the one. This is the one. Oh yeah, there we go. Oh god, hot. Okay, here we go. 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 Bless. <laughs> Hello, sir. He already knows what time it is. Oh, roo, roo. Oh my goodness, bubbies. Is it advent calendar time? We have to be advent calendar so I can curl up in a ball and die on the couch. I hope that's okay with you. I hope that fits into your schedule. Oh, ah! Woo! Oh God. I feel as if the crackhead energy right now is high. Also, I forgot that I have these like big wooly ass socks on. I'm a hot mess right now, y'all. Day five. Please be a treat, not a toy. Oh my god, I feel like you guys never get to hear Moose bark. He really doesn't bark. He's like not a barker at all, but he's a pretty vocal dog and like weird a woo and like grumbles. Oh, Bobby's is a new one. It's a new one. Wow. Let's see, this one looks like, are these jingle bars? Maybe this is a jingle bar. The jingle bars look like they have frosting on them and these definitely aren't frosting. Either way, I think they're gonna be delicious. What are these? Maybe it's a beef jerky or something. It looks like tempeh. Gentle. Ah. That was not the most gentle. Can I have this paw? Oh, thank you so much, Mr. Moose. Gentle. Ah. Last one. This is gonna be the most gentle. Bubbies, they can't see how handsome you are. Come here. Over here. Come over here. Sit. There we go. Now you get the full view of how handsome. Gentle. Ah, 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 ah. We won't tell Jeremy about that one. <laughs> okay, so we'll save these for another day. Also, guys, I've been thinking, so I don't know. Advent calendar is totally covered when I go to Big Bear this week because Jeremy has agreed that he'll do Thursday and Friday and send me just like some iPhone footage or whatever. But um, Moose is coming back to Canada with me on the 26th. So originally I was planning on doing like a little popo cake or something on the last day. Oh. These are jingle bars. Where did these just fall out from? 14? What happened? Oh, Jesus, 14. Because day 24 is a, day 24 is a giant toy, it looks like. <gasps> oh my God. Ah! Okay, sit, sit, sit. Oh my God, sit. <laughs> this is absolute chaos. Oh my God, bubbies. Oh my god. Oh my god. We are in shambles. I have to piece this whole thing back together. Bubbies. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so that's a problem for later. Sir. Uh, moose. <laughs> We've got a little bit of crackhead energy happening. What I was going to say is that on the 24th is the toy day that I was planning on getting a little moosey cake made. But because we're traveling on what would be day 25 of Vlogmas, I don't want to give him anything too weird for his tummy because we are traveling, so. Sir, get you, get you paws down. So let me know if we should pick a date. Maybe we just do day 15 in celebration of last year's Vlogmas and day 15. I guess I could just give him like a regular treat on the 24th, um, that would work too. So sorry if I just made your dog's ears perk up with the T-R-E-A-T -E word. I know Moose just uh, snapped back to life when he heard it. Anyways, let me know what you think we should do. I'm gonna skip the advent calendar. Um, do you have to yawn? What was that? <laughs> I'm gonna skip the treats from the advent calendar a few days leading up to travel, uh, cause I think they are making his poops a little bit weird. So anyways, I just don't wanna upset his tummy at all. So let us know what you think the answer is because we got a sensitive tummy and uh, no advent calendar prior to travel. All right guys, I am going to end the vlog here. I need to go lay in the fetal position on the couch and Moose is looking dead into my soul right now. Dead in, oh, and dead into your soul now too. You're welcome, I'm glad we could share that together. I'm gonna go lay in the fetal position with my uh, little heated, my he little heated plushie, and I will see you tomorrow for day six of Vlogmas. Okay, bye guys, love you. Say goodbye. Say goodbye. Say goodbye. Here is the pure chaos of <laughs> what used to be the advent calendar. <laughs> so I don't know uh, what order they used to be in, but I'm just gonna, I'm gonna just wing it and put all of those right back in there. Yeah, you did that. You did that!